needed permission. What do you think about the coronavirus? Have you got six thousand dollars? Otherwise, it's nice guy. buy one of these this morning it is a windshield for my microphone my microphone's been messing up a little bit lately so hopefully hopefully this makes a difference they call these things dead cats which is honestly kind of creepy all right we're good hopefully we're good hopefully this is making a difference welcome back to another brand new video everybody it is a Thursday morning it is 9 59 a.m. Kai Saunders is arriving in the city at 10 so in one minute from now. In my last video, which if you haven't already seen, I'll link it in the description below, I did mention that now, by law, the maximum amount of people allowed to turn up to like a, a, a social gathering in public is two people. Two people max. It was recently reduced from 10 people. You can get fined $11,000 and face jail time for up to six months, which is just mind-blowing. Like this... Th this whole thing is just so bizarre. I don't want to sound selfish. I know I'm not the only person on this planet and I could be affecting more vulnerable people. I just think it's so insane that it's now like illegal to be outside on planet Earth. It's crazy, man. At the train station this morning, just up the road at Wynyard, I was approached by one of the workers and actually first I got told off for filming in the station. I want to take the photo no photos in it. Really? You need a permission if you want to take a photo. I've never heard that before. That's a new one to me. I was then approached by one of the workers who was quite nice actually. He just kind of let me know that you're not supposed to be out today and then he asked me what I was doing. I said that I was working. Oh, is it? Yeah. Oh, okay, cool. Yeah, yeah. Oh, that's how you make money well. This right here and, and this is how I make a living. So technically I'm working. You are allowed to be outside if you're working or going to collect the essentials like going to the supermarket or the chemist or the pharmacy, stuff like that. So technically I'm working and exercising. Hopefully that passes as an excuse if a policeman approaches me asking what I'm doing out in the city today. Plus I am only going to be with one other person today which makes two people which is the maximum limit of people who are allowed to be at a social gathering which doesn't really make it a social gathering it's not very social if you're only with one other person I think a tourist bus just came in and there's policemen there already with face masks on Yo, man. I just met up with Kai we're grabbing some drinks Where's the first spot at? What do you think of the coronavirus, dude? What do I think? Well, I on honestly right. only like realized how serious it was in the last like week. Yeah, that's kind of like maybe, me too. Maybe even a few days. Like I thought everyone was just overreacting and it was just gonna all blow over. Yeah, like Australia was like still is late to like all the stuff. Yeah, like taking action and stuff. Like yeah. I feel like if we were in Italy and there were like literally people dying all around us, we'd be taking it. Like we we wouldn't be out today. What's going on, boys? Yeah, What's going on man? How are you doing? How are you going? What do you think about the coronavirus, man? Oh, fucking bullshit, bro. But you know what? What? The media make it too big. I don't care about it. Man. Yeah. I don't care. He's gonna die one one, one another. Hey. Oh, I'm not trying to die this early, but. But like yesterday, the news they saying, okay, you can't, you can't. One of the news saying, okay, you can't go to the park and do exercise. Yeah, it doesn't make sense. Another though, one. I want the police see you. Sorry, mate, by yourself. No one around you. Go. Yeah, I saw, I saw a news What's report this? yesterday, and yeah. they were just like telling people to go home. Who were just like. Just I feel like, like if they're going to lock it down, they should just fully lock it down, but... I'm doing my exercise in the middle of the park. Why did the police ask me to move? Have a good day, man. You, too, you, too. you know how the Simpsons have predicted a lot of stuff? Yeah. In the Simpsons movie, bro, they dome the whole yeah, place, man. Like, if I start seeing a dome coming, like, are, are, you, are you going out or, like, are you oh, in the dome? In? If, if yeah. there's a dome over fucking If there's a dome, Sydney? your family's inside, all your friends are inside. I guess I'm staying in. You're staying in? I guess so. Where else would <laughs> I'm I go? I'm probably bailing, but Crazy. the dome's there forever, dude. You're never coming back in to see anyone. Okay. 
Okay, no, I don't know. They're yeah, maybe I'm great. staying in the dome. Yeah, that's pretty. That's pretty gnarly theory right there. Maybe I gotta find a sinkhole. Hey, can I ask you one question? Are you making a lot like less money now because the streets are so empty? Um, I'm gonna tell you something that's really weird. Yeah. I'm actually making more. You're making more? How? Yeah, I'm the last street performer. The last street performer. There's nobody else. There's no one else for them to give their money to. It's good to get to know you. The poor birds have no one to feed them anymore. We just got to Hyde Park. Usually this place is packed if it wasn't for coronavirus. This cafe is usually packed. There's usually people playing chess here. Instead it's completely empty and we're gonna warm up on this rail. I've been here a bunch of times. Ah! Let's see a front 50 full whip. First trick of the vlog. Hey! I want to see front 50, front board 270. Oh my god. I want to give you props, but we're going to have to do Corona props today. Thanks, bro. I still appreciate that. It still means the same. <laughs> Oh, uh, yup. Anyway, I want to do like pop ups and manual on the precision to like front board whip. Even if it's a Lil John. <laughs> <laughs> so I didn't mean that little. Like... Front lip three. That's a little hard one, but I know you got that. Oh. There she is. Such a skinny run up. Oh! First tee. Oh my god. Dude, you could do a line, like hit that, and then hit this. I'm doing it. <laughs> He's still in the line. <laughs> Dude, I honestly don't know how I did that so long ago. Almost five years ago, I think four and a half years ago. It, it was at the end of 2015. I came along here, I did a whip front lip, downside finger whip to fake you. It was actually filmed by Kai right here, and four and a half years later, we're back. We've gone nowhere in life. Perfect. Perfect. You gonna go for the seven? Oh! Every time I go for a seven, I just start losing my like. Yeah. What's it called like axes. For yeah, spinning. the axis, bro. You can out. start going off axis, dude. And there it is, the off axis. You see what I'm saying? I, I swear it only gives you one try to land the 720. Dude, Always. You get like one try a month to do a 7. <laughs> <laughs> oh, to fakey man. Dude, you could probably do the fakey man, I'm not gonna lie. Kai and I were just talking about how nice this flat bar spot is when there's no one around and there's literally no, like there's one, two, three, four people that I can see within like 100 meters from me. And uh. Oh! Oh, 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 dude, you were fucking on that side. Bro. <laughs> By the way, these are my favorite pair of jeans. I actually got these from a thrift store. I've been thinking of making thrift store videos if they're still open during the coronavirus epidemic. I thought it'd be cool to make a vlog, me just going around to thrift stores and just like buying stuff, like a thrift vlog. Let me know in the comment section below if you want to see me do a thrift store vlog. I reckon that'd be pretty cool. It's a bummer that I fell in the water, but I can't complain, it was pretty refreshing. I was just thinking, usually when you're in the city, you can kind of like tell what time of day it is without checking your phone yeah. or any clock yeah. because you know when it's lunchtime, you know when it's like roughly 3, 4 p.m. people start heading home. Yeah. You know, if it's if you're in here early because everyone's like frantically trying to get to work. I have no idea what the time is. Luckily, the cops came in right after we stopped riding. Oh my god! Is you? Have you got six thousand dollars to give to him? Excuse 
loose ever. She's riding too. We are exercising at the same time, and that's I, I, all the reasons that they say you would be allowed out for, so. And I'm going shopping later on. Yeah. I'm just taking a massive and detour to one. the shops. Purpose, okay, we've got a fucking purpose. Everyone has a purpose. Getting followed. Thank you. I'm surprised the cops haven't said anything to us yet. I don't know if there's more cops out than usual or they're just easier to point out because there's nobody else around, but I've been seeing a lot of cops. It's so weird seeing this whole place empty. Like at this time of day, it's a Thursday, it's like the middle of the week. It's pretty scary. Me and Kai are playing a game of Dharma. We're both on DAM. Kai just did, what was it, cup, spike, triple ball flip? Yeah. I'm on the new trams. They only opened up and started running a couple of months ago. This is actually a pretty cool way to travel through the city. It started raining, the ground's soaking wet, but it's not really affecting me too much because I'm still soaking wet from like the waist down. This flat bar's been uncapped. It was capped for so, so, so long. Someone's come here and uncapped it. So we're gonna get a session in here to end the day. I think my camera died, but these guys kicked us out.